And Liam Rossini has opted for some change, especially in the attacking department. No recognised striker in the 11. Three changes, two fan drops, Sharp benched and Tyler Morton is named amongst the substitutes, having had a swollen ankle on Saturday. All sopping goal, Coyle, Jones, Greaves and Giles across the back. So Coyle back in from the start, meaning Slater pushes into midfield alongside a continental champion, John Michael Seri, straight back in after arriving back on Thursday. Jaden Philogene, Fabio Cavallio and Anna Zarori sit behind Abdush Amur. So how will that play out this evening? On the bench for Hull City, it's Eva Pandor, Sean McLaughlin, Ozan Tufan, Greg Doherty, Adama Traore, Billy Sharp, Tyler Morton, Matty Jacob and Aaron Connolly. And Coyle, facing his own goal, has managed to find Jones. Philogene is the potential recipient down the right and Coyle latches onto the ball on halfway. He's travelling quite rapidly. Now to Zorori. Zorori can't seem to get the ball on his right foot as well as he would like, but then he shoots at goal. 20 yards out, dipping towards the top left corner, just sails away from Bazunu's front post. Coyle, and then Seri, back to Allsop again, seeing a fair bit of the ball, Mara, Smallburn has tackled him on the edge of the area, and Southampton somehow have put it wide, because they were given free roam into the penalty area, in similar fashion to the way they squander possession the Tigers at West Brom, so it'll be interesting to see how he continues. Matty Jacob is on the bench, remember, as Giles still clutching the back of his leg. And he's having a little look towards Liam Rossini. Yep, he tries to burst into a bit of a sprint now as he gets onto a long ball. He's on the ball and he's comfortable on it. Plays it infield towards Carvalho. 20 out, spots Philogene. Philogene in the area, pushed out by Bazunu. But on the follow-up, Zorori with a side foot finish. And Hull City go 1-0 up after 11 minutes. Pressure sustained at one end. And a mistake by Bazunu, who'll be disappointed he's pushed it right into the heart of the penalty area. Giles went through the pain barrier in the build-up. And Zorori is up and running now in Hull City colours. It's Southampton 0, Hull City 1. Yes. Howard Bellis will play back towards Bazunu. He's another ex-Manchester City product. Last time he faced Hull City was playing in the blue of Rochdale with a certain Paul McShane sitting in defence in front of no fans, sadly, in the uh, COVID lockdown era. But a confident 2-0 victory and 3-0 victory for the Tigers on those occasions. As Philogene receives the ball right wing, skips around Manning easily, into the area, takes the shot on from a right angle. Saved though by Bazunu, Hull City try and reclaim possession on the edge of the air and have done. Just to the right of the six yard box, he danced around Ryan Manning. And Southampton are about to send their first few players up on a warm up as Ryan Alsop still hanging onto the ball in the penalty area. Liam Rossini is trying to get the attacking players moving in the right way and they've combined Zorori and Carvalho. Big clap from Rossini, 3v2. Carvalho free as a bird into the penalty area, plays sideways to Amur. A big touch and then shot as Philogene brought in a man in red to soak up some pressure. But Abdush Amur looks to the skies and knows that was such a big opportunity. But it's frustration of the fact that it's not a case of a chance that's just simply gone. They keep being built together as Philogene wins it and Carvalho scores! It's 2-0 Hull City and it's been coming! Fabio Carvalho over to the corner flag and Southampton so rusty and so poor in their back line. But Hull City in this first half have had the half of dreams. Not the most energetic of presses from Southampton, who look totally discombobulated. As a header, back towards Bazunu, and Philogene nearly pounced. Zorori's got the ball, he's gone to float it over Bazunu and wide. Every chance Hull City have is a full one. He controlled it on his thigh, 20 yards out, that's not far away. Long ball through again, appeals for handball against Ryan Giles. It did look like it struck the arm, he knew nothing about it. As Hull City play out of the back, and they've put five or six passes together, and it's eliminated seven in red. 
It's four against three. Coyle's joining in the fun. Coyle 20 yards out. Zaruri side foots it wide of goal. Southampton fans in a sense of bewilderment. They do not know what's happening to their team. Played wide now for Idoze. Idoze into the area with Brooks and then Manning. Manning with the shot. Shoots and wide. Scored last season against Hull City as a Swansea City man in the debacle at the Liberty Stadium. That was a 3-0 defeat as the Tigers look to wreak revenge. They are doing at the moment, but Southampton, with an hour gone, are stepping up the pressure. Ball into the area. Che Adams with the shot, wide of goal. Also had it covered. Didn't even die for it on his near post because he knew it was skittling away. Smallbone is travelling forward though in the meantime, he tries to shoot from about 20 yards, it's easily charged down by the Tigers. Traore, that's loose that time from the Tigers. And it invites Walker-Peters into the penalty area, unnecessary pressure building. It's a rebo, 20 yards out, Philogene again coming across, sticking a toe out, prizing the ball away. There's plenty in red still, Fraser to Brooks, decent ball into the area, comes to Che Adams, first header can't do anything, but then the shot from Aribo can, Southampton 1, Hull City 2, this game by no means finished, and Aribo has found the back of the net. Sulimana to the edges, Harwood Bellis the centre half, tries to shoot through the traffic, Hull City get a block in, then Traore does, Tufan just needs to get rid of it, and Hull City have done it! Hull City have withstood the last gas pressure, Southampton's winning run is ended. No delightful dozen for Southampton. All the joy is going back north with Hull City. The players sink to their knees in Southampton colours and the Tigers hug and embrace. Southampton 1, Hull City 2, on to West Brom on Saturday.